Hey everybody. Well, <laughs> I got some sunshine down here today. Uh, in and out. <laughs> it's been raining here just like you wouldn't believe it. Just torrential downpours that are just <laughs> would go for three and four days. Not even a not even a let up. It's been horrible. So it's really nice out here today. <clears throat> I thought I'd come out here since it's warm enough. Uh, it's a little cold outside. Inside I can have a t-shirt on. It's pretty nice. Have a nice beer. <clears throat> but I'm going to get this Dutch bucket system going behind me here today. Uh, and I'll, uh, I'll kind of give you maybe a little time lapse or something of me throwing it together. Uh, it, it probably won't be a step-by-step -step video. I, it, you know, I'm not really, uh, I'm not really talented in that <laughs> area of, uh, of uh, you know, putting things together. And, and uh, I'm not that technical. Okay, guys, that's it. I'm just a regular old guy doing this stuff. Um, because I'm having a lot of fun and I'm getting really good results and I want to encourage everyone else to do it. Um, I get a lot of mail privately uh, from people who don't have YouTube accounts. And uh, guys, I'm not an expert. <laughs> I'm not an expert at all, you know. Uh, I started this just, oh gosh, a little over a year ago and uh, kind of bumbling my way through it, finding things, learning things uh, through other guys' YouTube channels. So look, I'm no expert. Uh, I, I'm. You know, I share what I do and the way I do it. Um, you know, I, I could be completely wrong, but what I know is I've, I've had pretty good results uh, last year, and this year I'm looking forward to the same thing, so <laughs> we're gonna see anyway. Um, and, I, and while I was here, I thought I would show you that pepper that I had the pepper leaf problems with in my last video. Excuse me, it's hot. Um, so it's getting some nice peppers on it. Uh, it really got really, really bad after I showed it to you uh, for about a week, and then bang, she just took off again. I'm getting lots of flowering going, uh, so we'll see. I don't know if you ever get that whatever it was that I had, uh, don't give up. Just uh, keep on going, and uh, they seem to snap out of it. Well, yeah, it's about pretty much gone. Okay, well, look. I gotta get this Dutch bucket set up going here because it's getting time to where I can get reasonably close, close to bringing stuff outside, which I really wanna get going. <laughs> I'm like a horse jumping at the bit. So uh, anyway, I'll show you this one. Uh, it's just a basic Dutch bucket system. It's very much like the one in the center here. Same old thing. Uh, you guys have seen them in probably hundreds of videos from hundreds of people. But anyway, I'm gonna put another one in here because I really like the Dutch bucket setup. Uh, I, I find that they work amazingly well, amazingly well with not a whole lot of fuss. So anyway, I'll get that going and uh, I'll show you at least how I'm building mine. All right, guys. Okay, guys, I got all my buckets. <clears throat> I'm gonna use six. You can use more, get them tighter together if you want. Um, on my system over in the corner I found last year, I wish I kind of had them a little wider, uh, wider space. So I'm gonna try that. <laughs> I'm gonna try that this year. Uh, if not, I can just drill more holes in my drain and stagger them up. Won't be a big deal. So uh, what I'm going to do is I just got <clears throat> one inch hole saw, measured a little mark two inches up on each one of these things. Now that seems to work good for this system and that system, so I'm going to do it again. Anyway, so here we go. We'll just drill them up and then I'll put the grommets in and uh, you'd be surprised how quick these things are to build. <laughs> All right. So guys, there we are. We just uh, <clears throat> we just put them in there. I, I marked mine at two inches. Drill that one inch hole saw. Put a three uh, three quarter inch grommet on there, and they're really really good. <clears throat> I had uh, I had some mail the other day, and uh, a guy had wrote me, and he asked, uh, "When you're doing your new Dutch bucket system, do you have any trouble with the grommets?" Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they're hard. <laughs> they don't go in easy. I'll show you. <laughs> I guess he'd been having some really, really rough luck putting these in, and you know what? They can be, they can be kind of a bugger. But eh. I find that if you slide one side in first, just one little edge like that, and kind of hold her there, 
and I, I work with my other arm inside. <laughs> and uh, now, as many of these as I've done, I still have a, a difficult time sometimes. They just pop in and out. And uh, so as you can see, <laughs> as you can see, yeah, man, I have a really hard time with them too. But, you know, these grommets. Okay, so you see like when they first come in, they can be kind of, you know, all cattywampus and everything. So what you do in that case is you'll, if you just take a look, you just got to flip that one lip up. And if you look inside, you'll notice that that lip is kind of bent down. You get in there. <laughs> you get in there like, <laughs> like you know what you're doing. <clears throat> there we go. And then they straighten right out and they make a nice circle. So anyway, I got a lot of that to do. And I'll spare you that. I'll fire these guys in there and then we'll start cutting some tubing. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay guys, then when you get your grommets in, get your half inch tubing and some tubing shears. And uh, I've marked these off at seven inches, so I'll, I'll, I'll need seven of them. All right, six of them. <laughs> so I'll need six of these guys. seven inch pieces here with the half inch tubing and uh, what I do is I take a little bit of Vaseline and I put it on that guy because it's not getting it it's not easy getting it into these grommets sometimes guys and I've camp, uh, chamfered the edges just slightly right so they'll fit in nicely so there you go a little Vaseline that guy slide right in there and that's a done deal now, take a 90, pop her on that end, another 90, pop her inside and I'll show you, I'll show you how I have it going. I have it coming in directly facing right down at the bottom. Anyway, I'm not sure if you can see it in there, but that's the way I have the 90 go in, right, right facing downward. So there we go. I got six more of those to do and then we can get on to the next part. I mean, this is quick guys. I'll mount this on and I'm just using strapping. <clears throat> so what I'll do, I'll put this at a really nice angle. So I'm going to put this guy down here like so. And uh, I'll keep that nice and low. And I'll go down to the other end and when I've set it on, of course I'm going to kick it up at an angle. Just, just like all the benches in here, sometimes friends will come over and they'll think, what, nothing's level. Well, you're right, it's not, because all my benches and everything are built at different inclines, depending on which way I want the water to run back to the reservoir. So, okay, anyway, I'll go. Okay, that's strapped up there. Now what I'm gonna do, is just come along here, drill a hole right down in the top of each one, where each, uh, I want each one to be, and uh, bang, cut some more tubing, and this part's done. <laughs> Not much to her. All right, everybody, that's all installed. So uh, what I've done is, uh, <clears throat> after I've drilled my holes in the top here into the one inch pipe, I've uh, just cut various lengths of uh, half inch tubing again, just to, to make that 90 and then down into the pipe. And you can see my one inch is, is on, a, on a, uh, a gradual incline back here to the back. And that's just to keep everything going. And I got a little clean out in back uh, because I found out last year, <laughs> uh, it's really nice if you can blast a hose through there. Um, 
yes, yeah, stuff happens, right? <laughs> and I had root problems. Okay, now say, this is uh, just how the whole darn thing set up, guys. It's just a 90 right there. Comes in, I'll shoot you inside the bucket here. And uh, that might be very difficult to see. But it just goes down there and 90 straight into the bottom. And uh, that's enough relief for, uh, for the water to drain out. And uh, generally, it's, uh, it's all good. And uh, anyway, there we are for today. I'm gonna call this part one because, <laughs> man, this thing's getting terribly long. <laughs> so anyway, I still gotta do the reservoir and all that stuff. Um, tomorrow, the next day, whatever, if I get some more good weather, uh, we'll do part two. But I think I'm done for the day. Uh, I got some other stuff I gotta do. I gotta go in and check, actually check my seedlings. I've got some stuff going. So anyway, guys, listen, I was glad to have you along for the day. And until next time, we'll see y'all later. And above all things, be good to each other. Be good to each other, guys. Uvidíme se později. Buďte na sebe hodní